What's going on everyone? Welcome to another Rally Roots video. Let's get going. So yesterday I ran a poll on our Facebook group just to see what kind of wholesale our students want us to make for them this week. And it looks like, just by a hair, it looks like Vintage won. Vintage went out and then they wanted new with Tags Adidas. So I think that today what I'm gonna do is start building some vintage t-shirts maybe some vintage like hats and sweaters lots for our students and this will be cool because i can kind of show you guys the other side of our business the type of stuff that uh that we get and we sell in bulk um and how much we sell it for so that's what today's video is going to be about i guess speaking of vintage it does look like there's going to be some new vintage items in this wholesale box that i just picked up so i'm going to start going through this stuff and i'll probably pull some of the vintage stuff out of here to uh to make a lot for our students i have a little whiteboard set up here so i can kind of take pictures of each item that's going to be going into these lots just so that our buyers can see exactly what they're getting um and they can go do their research to make sure that it's worth it for them to buy i have this tommy bear from another lot i wonder if we should include that as well i was going to keep the tommy bear but I don't know, maybe they kind of belong together. <laughs> I love this shirt. I was gonna keep it for myself, but I think we should include it in the lot as well. Look, there's no place like home, protect, respect, global alternative, San Diego. Really cool graphic on it. Single stitch on the sleeve too. So that's the back and then it does also have the same emblem on the front. So I think it's a really cool shirt. I would say the value on something like this is probably like 30 to $40. So we'll throw that in the lot as well. Wow, look how old that Hanes tag is on this shirt. Pretty cool. I would say, what is that, like 70s, 80s ringer t-shirt? This one's super, super cool. It's like a 90s Disneyland Lion King t-shirt, single stitch. Very cool Dare t-shirt from 1999. There's some yellowing and some flaws to this one for sure, but still a really cool shirt. And this graphic, I've actually never seen this graphic before, so it's pretty sweet. I'm gonna throw both of these dead stock Guess jeans in the lot as well. So this one and this one. These are really rare. This one's probably worth like probably $100, $80 to $100. All right, this lot is packed up into a medium size Home Depot box. It's a total of 51 items and it is ready to go to one of our students. Some really good stuff in there. I'll go through all the pictures, add them to our website and price it out. All right, so here we go. I've loaded up this lot onto our website. Um, I was wrong, there's actually a total of 50 items and we have listed this lot for $500. And it really is a nice mixture of items. You've got the hats, the t-shirts, lots and lots of really good like vintage t-shirts in here. Obviously those dead stock jeans are great. Santa Cruz vintage t-shirts, pretty cool Paul McCartney vintage tee. There's some Nautica and some Polo and some Tommy, some sports related stuff. It's a really good mixture. And for our students, they can just log in, see everything there and then purchase it. We don't charge shipping on anything. So we eat the cost of the shipping. Um, so for $500, I, I think that on the low end, all of these items said and done should sell for around a thousand bucks. Um, so after fees and shipping, I would say our students should net around 700 to $750. So again, paying $500 to net 750. So they're actually making a net profit of around $250, which is about 50%, which on a wholesale deal is around about what we it's around about what we want to see and it's around about what we teach our students to look for. Again, could we make more money selling each item individually? Absolutely. Could our students go out and thrift 50 items and make more money than $250? Absolutely. Um, but that's not what wholesale is about. Wholesale is about putting money out there, not having to do as much work, so not having to go from thrift store to thrift store looking for these items. Um, and just having stuff come to you that's good, that you know will sell well, and uh, and putting it out there and listing it. It's just working, again, I, I know that it's cliche, but it's working smarter, not harder. And that's why we do this. And then the other thing is, you know, when we first started out selling on eBay, the hardest things for us to learn were what items sell well 
and where to find those items. So that's why we do this for our students so that they, they have an opportunity to um, supplement what they're doing uh, and not have to go and search for the stuff and not have to research the stuff. Because we know, you know, we've done this full time for five years. We know that these items are good and we're comfortable saying, you know, we're selling it to them for 500 and we know that they're gonna make money. So that's why we do this. It's just a, we've become like another little resource for our students. Allie's here. Here. Hey babe, I'm building wholesale lots. You wanna help? Yeah, let's cool. do it. What do you think we should make next? I did one vintage lot and we're gonna be doing some Adidas ones as well. Oh, should we do shoes? Let's do shoes. A lot of brand oh, spanking new shoes. My neck is Are you okay? Out. No, my neck is out. I can't like turn it all the way. Oh. Oh, fix me. Uh, I need a chiropractor. <laughs> Your mom. mom's a chiropractor. Mom. <laughs> we have a few different options. We have like, these look like used shoes, Uggs and Pumas and stuff. These look like used shoes as well more jordans and adidas and nikes new toms these are like cat steel toe i think yeah like steel toe work sneakers that would be an easy lot to do maybe we can do a lot of those more new shoes i think these are new shoes as well i think we're gonna go with new shoes because those seem to sell the best for our students so we're going to make a lot of brand new shoes. We're going to do another Home Depot medium size box. I don't think that many shoes will fit in there. So maybe let's do some like higher end ones. Allie's really good at packing shoes into boxes. So let's see how many we could fit in there. Definitely better at this than you. True. How many shoes do you think will be able to fit into this box? Depends on what sizes, but probably 13 on the high ends. 13 pairs? Well, it depends on what shoes. Well, let's go. Check. I can get like 70 Toms in here. <laughs> <laughs> Is this helping? <gasps> oh my gosh. No, <laughs> literally not helping. <laughs> All right, that's what I said. One, two, three, four, five, six pairs. But more importantly, how does my foot look? <laughs> this is 13. You think you can get all these in there? Yes. Yeah? Yes. Good luck. Good luck. Yes. Doing great. These ones aren't as big. These ones. Like this? They're not as big as the high tops. Okay. So, you can like give me more? Yeah. Two more? Three? Three more? Yeah. Okay. Three more pairs. Will it fit? Yeah, it'll definitely fit. I have extra space this time around. Nice, babe. I just like to put it in a certain way so that we don't damage the shoes. Right. So, so what was that? 16 pairs? Yeah. Nice. 16 pairs in a medium box. I could Good have job. done 17. Well, Overachiever. Overachiever. <laughs> so we'll tape this box up and then I will upload the pictures to our website and get them ready for our students to purchase tomorrow. All right, the shoe lots are getting loaded up and we'll be ready to go shortly. So I'm gonna keep building these lots, guys. I know that on that poll that I put out there on Facebook, um, the next one up that people wanted was New With Tags Adidas. And I have a whole box of New With Tags Adidas stuff right now. So. I'm going to get to work on that. But thank you guys so much for watching. I know that this was a bit of a different video, um, but you guys have asked a lot about our wholesale side of things. So I wanted to show you how it works. If any of you are interested in joining our, our mentoring group, we're doing another one September 15th and emails to sign up for that class go out September 7th. Um, I'll link our website in the description of this video where you can go and join put your email in and join the waiting list so you receive that email it's going to be a fun round of mentoring and we're hoping to get a decent amount of wholesale some more wholesale out for our students so that they can make some more money as well so thanks again guys i appreciate you watching please 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 hit the thumbs up button on this video we've been averaging like i think like 800 thumbs up so it would be awesome if you guys can hit that button for us and get this video to a thousand that would be cool so but thanks again for watching guys really appreciate it i'm ryan roots See you next time. Bye.